Rupert, is there any agenda that you want to share? Agenda that you... <laughs> <clears throat> no, not at all. I, I mean, I think that um, we don't have the power to change it. We, we obviously, if you're in media and you're concerned with what's going on in the world, you'd like to make a difference by putting forward your opinions. Um, but um, you're not going to change the world completely by that. Uh, I think we can. We can't change elections. Uh, I think good, strong news organisations can, by disclosing things, can help shape the agenda, but only in a limited way. For example, take the war. Uh, has I'm not just talking about the United States, but in terms of you having a global media enterprise, I mean, have you shaped that agenda at all in terms of perceptions of the war, in terms of how the war is viewed? No, I didn't think so. I mean, yeah. we've tried. <laughs> <laughs> tried in what way? <laughs> well, we basically supported yeah. uh, our papers and our television. I would say supported uh, the Bush policy right. in the Middle East. We've been very critical of its execution. Um, but um, it, our support hasn't meant very yeah. much because clearly public opinion now has grown very, very tired of the whole enterprise. 